Welcome to April Antoinette Glam, where you know we talk beauty, fashion, and fragrances. Oh, today, today, today. It's been quite a bit of time. I think a little bit over a week since I've recorded anything. I just really haven't been in the mood to record and edit and all the fun stuff that goes along with recreating a YouTube video. Um, but today I felt totally in the mood and I'm going to bring you my Sephora haul today. And I got to pick up this big box here. Sorry for it being <laughs> backwards. Um, but yeah, I am going to be showing you what I got in the Sephora VIB Rouge Spring Sale in haul format. You know we gotta get the necessary particulars out of the way. I would love for you guys to be a part of this family. Go ahead and click the subscribe button and go ahead and click the notification bell while you're at it. They're right next to each other so you can't miss it. Um, yeah, without further ado, let's get into all this haulage i'm so excited if you guys excited. have any questions about this makeup i'll list like the key products down below but i did a full get ready with me on my instagram page you can follow me there i do a lot of in feed and um in my story type of get ready with me it's like i do them um, maybe every other day or something close <laughs> to that but i do a lot of makeup work on that particular page so if you're curious about it and want to see how i did it you can head over to my instagram and that will be listed below let's get into what i got so i'm gonna kind of do them in category so let's start with fragrances so the first one is a pretty interesting one i only read the reviews on this particular fragrance and it was a blind buy i had never smelled it before because every time i go into a sephora i never see this particular one so again it was a blind buy but i'm pretty happy about it and that's from the house of mason margella um and it is a replica fragrance that's the line of his fragrances most of his fragrances and this one is called lipstick on so such a beautiful bottle now it's supposed to um be from chicago 1952 and the fragrance description is night night blush and rice powder so it's a very peculiar smell now for me i would not wear this alone this is like a base fragrance for me so i'll put this on and then layer something else on top it's such a pretty bottle i love their bottles and the simplicity of um the label that's on them so again, this one is not, uh, Lipstick On is the name of it by Maison Margiela. And I still have everything in their boxes. And then I picked up the Tom Ford Soleil Blanc Shimmer and Body Oil. Now you guys know how I feel about Tom Ford and this particular fragrance. I did a whole video surrounding this particular fragrance. So I went ahead and got the shimmer and body oil. I got the small one. Um, it's 1.5 fluid ounces, um, 45 milliliters, and it's just a beautiful body oil. Um, I'm going to open it so you guys can see so what it looks opening like. Opening the box and here she is. I want to show you the color of this situation it's so so pretty it looks really really good on the body especially when it's really really um bright out in the midsummer it's just so so pretty it's pretty on the beach it's pretty walking around the city it's pretty in any type of environment that you could possibly think of that's tom ford sole blanc shimmering body oil absolutely love it now we're moving right along i think that's the only fragrances that i bought in this sale i think we're I going missed to one fragrance i got a fragrance from sol de janeiro now if you know what sol de janeiro is they create this um brazilian bum bum cream and it has such an amazing uh coconutty type smell and i love it all year round but they have a fragrance centered around that scent so it is called um what is the name of this Okay, so it says Sol de Janeiro, which is the brand name. Oh, okay, so it's Sol Charosa 62. And this is what the bottle, bottle uh, the box, <laughs> the box looks like. Um, it did have this sleeve on it, um, if you care about that. And I will just open it up for you guys so you can see it. Such a heavy bottle, such a beautiful bottle. And this smells like absolute heaven. It is so good. They call it the scent of summer. Now, let me try to find some of the notes for you. Um, it's not very important, but I want to kind of give you 
a thought process around this the fragrance. The key notes in this are salted caramel, pistachio, and vanilla. It's a sweet gourmand fragrance. It is absolute heaven. It's like the epitome of summer. It falls into the same line as that Tom Ford Soleil Blanc. They kind of remind me of each other. And there's another fragrance um, by Laura Mercier. So, you know, Laura Mercier has her line of products. And she has one specifically called Ombre Vanille. I absolutely love that one. It's intoxicating. This smells almost exact to it. Um, but, yeah. <laughs> so, this for the summer is going to be epic especially paired with the brazilian bum bum cream which i didn't buy in this haul but i already had um one so yeah Cho uh, soul chirosa 62 so, now on to skincare i did not purchase very much skincare i'm sitting on tons of skincare now so i definitely they always seem to want to play around downstairs when i'm trying to film something and i'm on like the 20 something floor and you can still hear that all the way outside <laughs> sorry about that guys so i didn't buy a lot of skincare i did a replenishment of one of my favorite products and then i got something cool that i thought would um elevate my skincare regimen so the replenishment was the soothing cleansing oil from bobby brown this is the best cleansing oil on the market in my opinion none beats this one the price point is just very high so i try to wait till there's a sale to replenish this um because it's $50 by itself but it is so 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 good and this is what it looks like and it is just a facial cleanser in oil form it's just the best it breaks down all makeup it gets the face sparkly clean but then you still feel like your skin is moisturized so I cannot live without this stuff I absolutely love it a couple minis of things they came in like you know when you have so many points i'm a rouge person so i'm always with all these points i got a couple minis so green clean is a melt away makeup balm and this is by the brand pharmacy and it's just a cleansing balm breaks down the oil cleanses the face i got the mini version of that and then i got some of these um minis from what is this brand called drunk elephant um now drunk elephant is so popular in the skincare world um i always get the small ones because i'm not sure if they are what i'm looking for i like to test them out so it came with the proteiny poly uh, polypeptide cream so it's a peptide cream peptides are anti-aging can't lose with that then it came with a body lotion i didn't even know drunk elephant made a body lotion very small one then it came with a cream body cleanser like this and then it came with a little uh, cleansing balm their sway cleansing balm it's all the way in the bathroom i'm not gonna go <laughs> all the way in there to get it but it came with that as well and it's about this size so those are the little minis that i picked this up it's the coolest thing ever um it's their facial cooling globes so it's two globes um let's read what it does facial co cooling globes it's this two-piece set of facial cooling globes helps soothe and massage your face and neck the rounded shape makes it easy to roll around the contours of the face and neck the cooling sensation is believed to help with the appearance of puffiness so i'm gonna incorporate this in my skincare routine in the morning um do this and then follow up with my serums and so on and so forth but i just thought this was such a cool little thing to buy i'm gonna try to open it so i can show you what the cooling globes look like and then you should um i think it's recommended that you put them in the refrigerator so hold on one second i'll open it cute are these oh my god i'm like so excited to use these these are the facial cooling globes i'm not gonna put it on my face now because i have on tons of makeup but how adorable are these can't wait to use them Time for makeup products um i got quite a bit of things for the makeup portion uh this one is not going to be so long but longer than the other portions so let's start with fenty i got quite a bit of things from fenty so i got this little set um it's the let's see what she's called it has a uh, Diamond Bomb Baby is the name of the set. And it has the Diamond Bomb all over Diamond Veil. And then it has the Gloss Bomb in Universal Lip Luminizer in the color Fussy. So I do have Fussy, which is the pink Gloss Bomb. I hate destroying packages. But I can't keep all this crap, all this paper. 
but this is the um fussy color it's just a nice pink and she makes the absolute that's fdny <laughs> i cannot get this video out without all this chaos anyway so i had this already okay i got all wait. that chaos out but this is real life <laughs> and things happen. But anyway, we were talking about the Fussy Gloss Bomb. She makes the absolute best lip glosses. I love them. And they look really, really good with or without anything underneath. So if you just want to do a lip liner and a gloss, perfect. If you want to do lip liner, lipstick gloss, perfect. If you just want to do the gloss, perfect. Love these. But this is the one called Fussy. And then it comes with a mini diamond diamond what is this called diamond bomb in how many carats it's so pretty and i've been seeing like people put it like on the body and that's why i wanted to try this so there's one of that. her kilowatt freestyle highlighting duos this one is ginger binge and moscow mule they're like on the pinkyish kind of rosyish type of spectrum and I just love Fenty's packaging. Absolutely beautiful. I know I'm gonna get a lot of use out of this. Anything in that pinkish family, pinkish tone, I'm gonna absolutely love it. I hoard pink items. <laughs> so the lip gloss is kind of a pink theme. The highlighter is kind of a pink theme. And then I got um, something that was out of the ordinary from them. It's called the Kilowatt Foil Freestyle Highlighter Duo. So this is a dip different type of color. And her packaging is just beautiful. I'm a sucker for packaging. By the way, same white case oh the little paper fell out but isn't this pretty so this is um mimosa sunrise and sangria sunset stunning i don't know what i'm gonna do with it but i just had to have it the colors were just so pretty and yes it does have like a pinky pinky purpley type of color in it but I love it. Fenty. I got a Fenty Fairy Balm Shimmer Powder. I got a lot of shimmer. I love to do up the shimmer in the summertime. Hopefully we get to go somewhere. Hopefully they let us off a lockdown and it is safe and serene. And, you know, we can go out and do our normal stuff. But if they don't, I'll wear it for you guys on YouTube and on Instagram. <laughs> but this is the, um, again, the Fairy Balm Shimmer Powder. And I have it in Rosé on Ice another pinky tone now i don't think you're going to really be able to see this because i don't want to take the um the protective packaging of, off of it but if you can see it is like a rosy gold type of color and it comes in this cute little container like could you die i love it um so those are the I things that i got some of these things. melted matte and melted wait okay let's read this name correctly matte and metal melted shadows from huda beauty now i already had two i had what colors are this shimmering sunset with private jet and then i had minted and De Niro. so those are the two that i had and then i picked up french lace with diamond drip and penthouse suite with cashmere robe so this one is more of a nude color so this is a liquid eyeshadow and then it has a liquid shimmer on the other side very easy eye look like this is the easiest eye look that you could ever create and then the french lace one with the diamond drip it's purpley like a lavender which i've been obsessed with lately i've been like wanting to do lavender eyeshadow every day and you can't do eye lavender eyeshadow every day but i've just been like super obsessed with it so i got those from huda I got beauty this milk makeup tattoo uh style tattoo stamp um it's the one that has the hearts on it so that's what the tattoo comes out looking like and I did open this prior because I used it in one of my Instagram videos so I wonder why it's so hard to get open now but you just stamp this wherever you feel okay why did I do it that way let's try to do it this way makes more sense 
So that's what it looks like when you stamp it on your hand or your face or whatever have you. Let's do one. Should I put one on my face? Super cute. <laughs> I love things like this. I usually will draw two dots or um, put rhinestones or something like that. I just like anything sort of creative. So this was super cute to me. And I think it only retailed for like $12. Totally for another it. Huda Beauty product that I got. Um, but now I just realized that I have it. So let's talk about that. And I'm opening the packaging. It's one of her um, mini eyeshadow palettes. I love her eyeshadow palettes. Like I use them so much and this one is all oh my gosh this is so pretty it's all neon colors so this is the neon one i have the neon green one and i've used that in a video that i did on instagram but i needed these orange neon colors honey oh my gosh look at that i cannot wait to do something fun with that could you die could you die this is so pretty I could see myself using all of this situation. And it has pinks in it too. Like, so that to was the Huda Beauty Neon Obsession Palette. So I got the liquid uh, matte and metal shadows and the palette from Huda Beauty. Now we are rounding off the last bit of our haul Back with two NARS items from NARS. I got a new bronzer. Now I got the um, original, I think it's Laguna. So there's two. One is Casino and one is Laguna. I have one of them, the darker one, but they released new bronzers and they're the, they extended the range. And then I, they, they have like a, I have to show you the format because it's kind of hard to explain. Well, it came in this packaging and then you know it's the signature matte black from NARS and it says NARS matte on it but it's supposed to be a more silky type of formula and this color is called Samoa matte so it's a little bit darker than the one that I previously had which I think is Laguna I think it's Laguna um, but yeah the new bronzer and then in the same collection they had this infused oil infused lip tint and this is in laguna so i think this whole collection was surrounded around their bronzer collection so they made a lip color in the same type of situation <laughs> as laguna and it's super pretty all of nars packaging is luxe and fabulous so you never go wrong with anything from nars but it's like a tinted lip oil and it's like a bronzy color let's put a little bit of this on love it now this is another product that you could either wear alone or wear on top as a topper on lipstick or just the lip pencil whatever floats your boat and that's it guys that is the ending of my vib rouge spring sale haul. Oh, that is such a freaking long name now i think they only do this sale twice a year spring and then the fall if i'm not mistaken and it goes by the tiers the first tier is insider i think you get 10 percent off the second tier is vib i believe you get 15 percent off and then rouge when you spend a thousand dollars or more per calendar year you get 20 or 25 percent off and a longer amount of time to do so so if you are a Product hoarder like me, it's very, very easy to get to Rouge status. But either way, it was a good percentage off. Um, I had fun shopping, of course. Um, yeah, let me know what you guys got. If you got anything during this particular sale or if you wanted something but just didn't you know, get around to getting it. And let me know what you thought about the stuff that I picked up. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully I'll see you guys back here soon. Stay safe, stay amazing, and we'll talk soon. Deuces.